I actually tried out so many newly launched skincare products and makeup products in the month of May and today I have a video for you guys. I'm going to talk about my May favorites. I have few skincare products with me. I have few makeup products with me and also I have some beautiful lip shades as well. And yeah, without any further ado, let's get into this video. I'm going to start off with some skincare products and the first skincare product is this one. This is the Laneige Cream Skin Refiner Mist. I purchased this from Nika and this is not the first time I tried out this product. Months and months ago I tried out this product. They sent me a PR package I remember and after that I never really tried this product. I purchased this and I thought of okay I know it's expensive but let's try it out once again and oh my god this is my favorite 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 toner and it is also like a moisturizer to me it is so hot outside and i know like applying moisturizer can be the toughest part uh, in your skincare routine what i do sometimes i skip my moisturizer and i spray this all over my face just a little bit and it acts like my moisturizer this is my skin is a combination skin if you have dry skin this can be your perfect moisturizing toner and if you have oily skin i will say skip this product because it is extremely hydrating like if you talk about extremely hydrating product this is something i will recommend and this will not disappoint you it is worth every single penny and it is super lightweight very very absorbing your skin is not going to feel oily and greasy after using this which is the best part yeah after finishing up this video i'm going to remove my makeup and i'm again going to use this product the next skincare product is this one this is the cosarex aha and bha clarifying treatment toner now if you are looking for an exfoliating product any exfoliating toner which is going to exfoliate your skin this is a beautiful product this is the mini size by the way and i'm definitely going to purchase the bigger one because it is so good i don't use it every single day because it is your exfoliating toner and exfoliating your skin every single day is not good maybe three to four times a week that you use it all over your face you you will like feel that your skin is so smooth it looks just like water it is not going to hydrate your skin or anything like that it is just going to make your skin feel very smooth and also it is uh, going to balance up your skin pH level at the same time have like sensitive skin or acne prone skin or combination skin this product is so good does not contain any like harsh smell it contains a smell but it is not too much and which is the best part if you don't want to invest in a bigger size one try out the smaller one obviously this is skincare this is not going to work like magic you have to stick around with the product for a while and then only it will start working with hyaluronic skin. acid is my favorite type of uh active ingredient which i really love in my skincare product and this one from foxtail is beautiful this is their daily hydrating serum i have recommended this product a lot and this is for all skin type by the way first of all packaging beautiful such a cute baby blue color and it is such a lightweight serum you can see the dropper the packaging everything is so good plus it is affordable at the same time if you want to use this just as your serum you can definitely do it if you want to mix it with your moisturizer to give you more hydration you can do it as well it's not feel greasy at all it is going to absorb into your skin so beautifully but still your skin is going to feel super hydrated at the same time and this is for all skin type by the way this is a glass bottle okay not a plastic the next one is this sachet Shado, I can never pronounce this brand. Sishado Clear Sunscreen Stick, and this contains SPF 50 plus and i am loving this sunscreen stick because it is clear it is non-greasy non-oily extremely lightweight and also you can use it anytime it is perfect for reapplication as well i love this i always carry it with me in my purse and whenever i feel like i need some sunscreen on my face on my hands i just use it and i don't know why but this is so good it is also water resistant up to 80 minutes this is vital for a reason i have tried out so many different sunscreen sticks before i also have super goop sunscreen stick but i don't use it 
just because how oily it feels on my skin and I literally don't love it. But this does not feel oily at all, especially during this That's summer. That's it for the skincare products. Now let's move on to our makeup product. And the first product I have is this one. You guys have probably seen this a hundred times. This is ELF All Night Micro Fine Setting Mist. And this will make your makeup last, uh, this says 16 hours, but I will say maybe 24 hours because it is so powerful. It does not feel like you have a setting spray, like your face is not gonna feel tight or heavy, nothing like that, but it is so long lasting. If you are a big fan of the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray, and if, if you don't have the budget for that, go and grab this one. It is so good. And I'm also thinking of buying the blue light one that they also have. It's so cute, the blue packaging. For 1190 rupees, I know it is a little bit expensive, but it is worth it, guys. This particular setting spray, the mist is so fine. It says that it contains a micro fine setting mist. And yes, the mist is super Next fine. Next one is this skin tint from Rimmel London. This is such a beautiful product and I am in love with this shade called Classic Beige. It is always out of stock, but I have it with me. This is my perfect, perfect shade match. Like whenever I blend this skin tint all over my face, it feels like I literally have nothing on my skin. Also extremely lightweight, hydrating at the same time, hydrating, it will make your skin glow, but it is still going to feel super lightweight on your skin, which I really, really love. Rimmel London actually, they have some amazing products, but I don't know why they don't market it that much. And it's super travel friendly at the same time. If you want a skin tint, which is not going to feel like a skin tint, and it is also not going to feel like a foundation, still you are going to get coverage. Try this. You will love this it. This eyeshadow topper, which I don't know how I have never used this product. This is actually available on my hype store. Oh my God, this eyeshadow topper is magical. I'm gonna put a picture right over here. I'm gonna put a video or picture right over here. So you can see how beautiful this is. I think in person, it looks so magical. I cannot even explain how beautiful this particular product is. It is, uh, it is gonna give you that fairy, magical, iridescent, glitter kind of a vibe. It's shimmer shades, which does not feel like shimmer, you know, it feels like a very light amount of like glitter dust over your eyelid and it is so pretty. Like a little bit of a brown eyeshadow with some topper like this. Oh my God, perfect. Trust me, trust me. Everyone gonna ask you, what do you have on your eyelid? I have used this product so much and I think this will last me for five years because this is so much blush. This is Rare Beauty uh, liquid blush in the shade Hope. And what a shade guys, what a shade. This, uh, if you think that Rare Beauty blush, they are very pigmented and you want to use the blush in a proper way, I think go for Hope because it is the perfect, perfect color of blush which will not feel extremely pigmented and you can take like more than one dot because most of the Rare Beauty blushes you just can take one dot and that is enough. This one you can take two to three dots and it is so pretty. A glowy and a matte version and I think this one is the glowy one because it makes my skin, it makes my cheeks glow whenever I use it. It is not pink for any reason, it is not like a peach, it is something in the middle. It's a combination of pink and peach, which I really love because sometimes we do feel like, oh my God, the blush is too pink for me. Sometimes we feel like the blush is too peach for me, but this is the perfect combination that you can ever think of when it comes to blush. Okay, now my most used brush, uh, this is from Mars Cosmetics. This is their four in one brush. I'll link this for you. It is also available on my Hype store and also on Mars website. And if you want to purchase it, you can use my code Antra10 and you will get 10% discount. It means so much to me whenever you guys use my code. Thank you so much for supporting. Very minimum amount of work that you are doing, but it is helping me a lot. Thank you so much for that. And yeah, this is a brush which you get a foundation brush, you get a powder side, and you also get your eyeshadow brush right over here. Many people purchased this brush on my recommendation, especially from my store, and 
put so many good things about this brush and I'm just overwhelmed with the response because it is actually the best investment you can ever do. You can check out my Instagram reels and you will see me using only this brush. Lastly, I have two beautiful lip shades. I know you guys are going to ask me what I have on my lips. So I have this Recode Studio Pro Liquid Lipstick in the shade Chocolate Day. That is what I'm wearing on my lips right now. I'm also going to link this in my description. This, I purchased it from my store only. It is such a beautiful chocolate color. That is why the name is Chocolate Day. A perfect chocolate nude shade what you can ask for it is a matte liquid lipstick extremely lightweight not going to emphasize your uh, like texture on your lips and also the applicator is so good and if you want a nude lipstick for your everyday makeup go with this chocolate day called 14 and you are gonna love 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 this color it is so good and if you have more dusky skin tone try it out with a brown lip liner or try out this combo and you will thank me later if you are not into like nude shades like this if you are more into pink or a rosy tone nude shades like this try out this one from love Art. again i'm gonna link it for you this is in the shade espresso martini so many people actually purchase this product and yeah you can definitely see the shade this is the exact color you will get look at this so pretty it feels like a velvety mousse type of a liquid lipstick and it is super super lightweight at the same time if you want to get their like set they have like a mini set where you will get all the shades you want from their liquid lipstick collection also they have some extremely pigmented lip gloss set at the same time also you can purchase it individually if you want i'm gonna link everything for you this is a perfect rosy tone nude color for your everyday trust me it is so good again if you have a more dusky or brown skin tone try it out with a brown lip liner and you will see how stunning it is gonna look espresso martini is my favorite and record liquid lipstick in the shade chocolate date is so good that's pretty much it guys what do you guys think let me know in the comments below which are your favorite products and what are the products you think that you have used so much in the month of May and you really really loved it please let me know in the comments down below I really really want to try out your recommendation and yeah guys thank you so much for watching I love you guys so much and I will see you guys on my next video bye